What to do, it's your boy RC Trav checking in. Just want to let y'all know we are back. Uh, I know I took a little break uh, from making videos and the RC hobby in general. Just life has gotten in the way, a lot of stuff going on. But uh, the dust has settled a little bit, so I'm back on the workbench. We're going to get it dusted off. And I uh, just want to let you know where we're at. So the last video, I believe, with this car in it, we were at the track, and I had a mishap. I broke uh, this little hub which had ruined my day. Um, and then the thing with that part was, it was on back order. It's been on back order for like three months, guys. So finally, a main uh, emailed me, let me know the part was in stock. And so I was able to get them. Now I could have upgraded to the kit parts. I even had went on eBay. I could have got them for a good price, but like I told you in some other videos, you know, I'm, I'm kind of done really with the hop ups with this bad boy. I'm just using this bad boy. It's pretty much track practice and a basher. Um, I even thought about making it an on-road car, but uh, I don't think I'm gonna do that. I'm gonna keep it a buggy. I'm still gonna be running it at my local track, but I'm just not gonna put a lot of money into the kit parts for this. So it took a while, but these are the parts that are ready to run. Uh, knuckle arms that came on here, they broke. Hopefully, uh, I probably should have ordered a couple of them. Now I'm thinking, I'm just now thinking about it. I probably should have ordered a couple of those. Um, but I'm gonna get these thrown on. I don't know if you can see that thing snapped. I don't think you can see what it snapped on the inside. Let me get it. Where it bolts down to this screw. Uh, it snapped over a big jump. And so that ruined my day. And then uh, just after that, man, just got home. I didn't even clean these bad boys, man. Just life got at me fast, man. And so um, with that being said, I'm gonna get this bad boy cleaned up. We're gonna put the parts on. We'll probably get it back down to the track. The local track is having a big toys for tots coming up. Um, I think I am gonna try to jump in for that. Um, track body, in good shape. But you know what? I decided to order me another one. I want something a little bit more brighter. Probably something more closer to the green. Um, as you can't tell, it's an MP9 Evo 2 with that body. You know, this is my little track body, my little beater, but I'm gonna paint that one up a little bit closer to that. As you know, I just didn't wanna damage this body. I wanna keep this body in good condition. You know, I even changed the wing. The wing is kinda getting beat up, but that's what it's for. So I still have the original body and the wing that is in perfect condition. Um, and this thing is pretty much in good condition. Um, you know, I had some issues with this uh, in the beginning, but we got that all sorted out thanks to a lot of help from the YouTube community. And uh, here we are. So we'll get these thrown on. Hopefully you'll be seeing this bad boy on the track for real soon. And uh, we got a whole lot of content coming up for you guys. So stay tuned. The channel's only gonna get bigger and better. Uh, we're almost at 300, uh, which is really surprising to me. Uh, cause I'm just a novice. I don't know a lot. I don't have a lot of information to give. I'm just showing you my journey, but people are, are tuning in. So I'm happy about that. And hopefully as I get better, the channel gets better and, uh, who knows what can happen. So it's your boy RC Traveling. You know, we back and, uh, y'all have a good day. Don't forget to like, subscribe, comment, share, all that good stuff. The boys out.